What's the deal YouTube? I'm back here again with another unboxing today. And this is a fragrance I've seen all over the internet. Whether it's YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, I'm seeing this fragrance everywhere. And if you can see by the title, thumbnail, let's get into it. Let's get in. So for this unboxing is really with just, I don't wanna say trash, but I know the whole process of this was just like all over the place, like all over the place. But this is off non 9 p.m. What I mean to tell you, I've seen this fragrance all over TikTok, all over TikTok. So I just move the box off the way. And I can't get it open now. So, for the most part, pretty chill, regular box, off 9, 9 p.m. 100 ml. I uh, got the ingredients on the back. Uh, nah. Let me see if I can find any notes on off nine, 9 p.m. Okay, okay, okay. One thing is, I'm not really a big fan. I'm trying to see if I can smell anything through the bottle, but this is the off nine bottle. Um, I'm not really too crazy about their bottle. Their bottle is kind of the heck? Is mine broken? Is the bottle supposed to come like that? <laughs> I don't know if my bottle is broken or what. But let's see, I'm gonna put it back on there real quick. So it clicks on. Nice black bottle, says 9 p.m. on it. You can see all the fragrance to the inside, but I don't know if this is something that's supposed to be on the bottle or not. I'm trying to see if I smell anything. <clears throat> but let's check the atomizer. Put it sideways. Hmm. It's nice and refreshing. It's not a bad smell. I mean, Smells pretty good. But for the notes in off 9, p off 9, 9 p.m., you got vanilla, amber, warm, spicy, sweet, cinnamon, fruity, lavender as well, powdery, aromatic, fresh fragrance. Not bad though. It's not, it's not bad at all. It smells pretty good, actually. It's not something that I'm crazy about, but it has a good smell. Like it's not a bad smelling fragrance at all. Like it, it has a decent smell to it. Just nothing I guess I'm too crazy about, but it does smell good though. Yeah, off 9, 9 p.m. If I could rate this fragrance from one to 10, it's hard for me to rate, I'm not gonna lie. Like just fresh off the rip, I'll probably give it like a solid, like seven fragrance. You know, actually like really rate it, I'll probably have to wear it like all day. But let's go over some pros and some cons. So some pros, it says good heavy cap with gray sprayer, similar to JPG, JPG Ultra Male. I don't have Ultra Male, so it's kind of hard for me to actually like say, but that might be a fragrance I should look into. Blind by Worthy, good longevity apparently. Leave a nice scent bubble around you, lasts, lasts for days on clothing, and it's a versatile fragrance. Now, let's go to cons. It says linear, poor performance in some batches. It could be a hit or miss. 
becomes a skin scent after one hour. Um, feels like more of a female fragrance. No projection, very weak. So those are the pros and cons of off non 9 p.m. Um, now that I have it, I wear it, I'll see how it does. And we'll see how much weird off non 9 p.m. gets out of me. But for the most part, man, pretty decent. I don't know what's up with that, but pretty decent fragrance, great atomizer. Uh, smells nice and fresh. And thank you guys for tuning in and watching another video. Off 9, 9 p.m., is it worth it? I don't know, maybe you should try it out, but I got it for roughly, got it for roughly, I can't remember, but it was around that $25, $30 price range. Um, wasn't nothing too crazy or nothing too expensive, but should I recommend it? If you want a cheap fragrance that smells good, this will be a go-to. Um, honestly, I do recommend it after continuously spraying it on my hand. I think it's a nice everyday fragrance that you can't go wrong with. So if you want a nice cheap fragrance that smells pretty good off 9 p.m., go get it. Thank you guys for tuning in, watching another video. I'm out.